my first style in this video is that girl and you know exactly who I mean. She is all over your Insta feed wearing this brown brandy hoodie. She buys clothes to fit all of the trends and then never wears them after a few months. Some accessories that I paired with this outfit were some minimal gold jewellery, a black mini bag and some platform trainers. Some activities you'll find her doing is taking Insta photos. This one is my fave pose, but I could not balance. And she's always looking put together 24 seven. The next aesthetic in this video is one of my faves. Some accessories I put with this outfit were these cute white socks and a plain white tote bag. The ribbon in the hair is an essential too. Some activities you'll find her doing is making everything smell nice and journaling because taking care of her mental health is one of her top priorities, as it should be. This next aesthetic is the overgrown child and this basically just sums up my personality. She'll be carrying stitch everywhere and always wearing pigtails. The backpack is definitely a must, it just screams kid vibes to me. Some activities she'll be doing is playing on her DS and always winning obviously. And also eating way too much candy. This next aesthetic is the cute cool girl that I want to be. She wears leg warmers, the cutest jewellery and always has the best hair. I absolutely love this style and it is one of my faves. Some activities she'll be doing is hot girl shit, including screaming Taylor Swift lyrics and always looking her best. She wears pattern tights and low rise, which is something that I really want to do if only I had the confidence. This next aesthetic is a 90s MILF. This outfit gave me so much confidence, you have no idea. Like, look at me, I don't even know what was going on. I basically just paired a mini top with some big pants. And activities that she'll be doing is singing the words to her favourite pop songs and always applying lip gloss to make sure she is looking as hot as possible at all times. I actually love this top, I got it off Depop for like £3 and it is amazing. The next aesthetic is that brandy girl and she'll definitely have a collection post on Depop, you know what I mean, and always be wearing the cutest clothes. Some activities she'll be doing is taking Polaroid photos with her friends and always being happy, I literally don't know how. I really love the brown and green combo and I think the pink cardigan really matches it well. The next aesthetic is the film student one. I study film, TV and radio and if my course was a person, this is what I think they would look like. She's always learning about ISO and aperture and taking photos on her film camera because she is edgy. This neck aesthetic is fairy core and I love this one. She's wearing the cutest jewellery and floaty clothing. Some activities that she'd be doing is running through a field of flowers barefoot and going on picnics with her friends in the summer. Having fairy dust is also a must of course and I really do love this outfit I think it is so cute and I just love this top my mum found it and I was like why have you been hiding this from me now this one is the folklore evermore cottage court you know what I mean she's obsessed with Taylor Swift and the recent vibes of folklore and evermore for this of course I was wearing my cardigan and this t-shirt just screams cowboy like me some activities she'll be doing is reading and dancing to Taylor Swift songs in her bedroom, obviously. 
Now this hairstyle was just perfect. I was like, I have to do this and it looks exactly like the front cover. Thank you so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it and if you want to see more fashion from me then don't forget to follow my instagram and like and subscribe and i'll see you all next thursday Bye.